Hello, hello, and today I'm going to show you how to make a non-printing layer in Adobe InDesign. Now, a non-printing layer is exactly what it sounds like. It's a layer that doesn't print or export from your InDesign document. So these are fantastic for having information in your document that you might not want to export, or you can use it for things like custom guides, which is primarily what I use it for. They're all around just a really great way to just have more information for yourself in your document. To get started, we're going to open our layers panel. To get that, we're going to go window and then find layers here. I've only got one layer on my document, so I'll add a new one by clicking this little plus here. To make this into a non-printing layer, I'm going to double click it and I'll rename it to non-printing. And here we have this toggle for print layer, so I'll turn that off. And when I click OK, you'll see that it is now italics, the title of the layer. So that's how we can tell between our printing layers and our non-printing layers. I'm going to add a shape to my non-printing layer here. So I'm going to use the rectangle tool, shortcut for that is M and I'll just draw it on there. Right now it has no fill or no stroke, so nothing would print anyway. So I'm just going to hit D to give it a black stroke. V to go back to the move tool, and when I click off you can see it's right there. And when I switch to our print preview mode, which is the shortcut W, like that, you'll see it's gone because it won't print. W again to get out of preview mode, and if I were to move that to layer 1, and then hit W again, you'll see our rectangle is there in our print preview. So that is how non-printing layers work. They will not export at all unless you choose them to. So let's export this as a PDF. We'll go File and then find Export. And I'm just using Adobe PDF Print. So we'll go Save. And down here, we have export layers, visible and printable layers. So this is what's on by default. And if we click that drop down, we can choose all layers, which will export our non-printing layers. Uh, but if we leave this on, it won't export. So I'll click export. And what we should have is a blank PDF document. So that's over here. And yes, there is nothing in our PDF. So that is how non-printing layers work in Adobe InDesign. If you liked that video, please like and subscribe, and I hope to see you again soon.